Some of the earliest surveillance video captures Jamie Macedo waiting at the entrance to Washington, D.C.'s subway system at 728 the morning of July 5th. Over the next 30 minutes, the situation escalates, ultimately leading to the death of 25-year-old Max Emerson of Crestwood. Police say Emerson encounters Macedo, appears to give him something, and then walks away. But Macedo follows him. This image shows Emerson trying to walk away with his hands up. Emerson appears to be on his phone, and investigators believe this photo shows Macedo holding his waist area. Then this image shows them walking away together. Now, police in Washington, D.C. said they thought Emerson might have known his suspected killer, but Emerson's family refutes that. They say he was in D.C. for a conference and was on his way to that conference that morning when he encountered Macedo for the first time. The only thing I can think about with that is that um, Max is a really friendly person and would talk to anybody, would, you know, this guy may have lured him with a conversation, uh, walking down someplace, and then I did get, but then at around the time that he was shot, I, like maybe five minutes before, I did get the snap that said help being robbed at gunpoint. The two men ended up on the campus of Catholic University of America, where Emerson was staying near the subway. Police say these images show Macedo robbing Emerson before Emerson tackles Macedo and the two struggle on the ground. Emerson, a teacher and wrestling coach at Oldham County High School, was shot in the abdomen and died. Now Macedo is charged with his murder. Mark Vanderhoff, WLKY News.